Welcome back. You know how much we love Portland Playhouse here on Everyday Northwest. And the last time they were in studio, we learned about the upcoming play, Chicken and Biscuits. Well, this time around, <laughs> uh, we are talking to the actresses of Chicken and Biscuits. We have two of the stars, Brittany M. Caldwell and Ashley Radney. Hi, ladies. Hi, hey. how you doing? Good Thank morning. you so much for being here. <laughs> Thank you for, having, for having us. Like I said, we love Portland Playhouse, love getting involved with the community. So tell me a little bit about Chicken and Biscuits. Chicken and Biscuits, I would say, is a family comedy okay. surrounding drama, okay. right? Um, but it's definitely about love and healing and family and all the intricacies that go into families. All right, so this is a family film, it or is, a family play. It's a yes. family play. Okay, love that. Now tell me a little bit about your characters. Well, I play Latrice, which is Beverly's daughter, <laughs> and she is a very outspoken, I would say truthful person. Okay. Yep. Um, that just doesn't care and has a good time on the stage. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And, and what about your character? Um, Beverly is, this is everybody's auntie. Um, oh, okay. She's fun. She's loving. Um, but she doesn't have a filter. Mm, all right. <laughs> we love those aunties, though. We love those aunties. I have a few in my family. <laughs> Shout out to Auntie Rob and Auntie Stacey. <laughs> Yeah, so this is, I can just tell it's going to be good. Why do you think we're picking this play at this moment? Um, you know, everybody's gone through a lot mm -hmm. over the last couple of years. Very true. Um, and I would say COVID, it showed you who really matters to you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because you had to choose. When you had to quarantine, you had to choose who was in your life for two years. Mm -hmm. um, and this is about making choices for the people you love the most and choosing into the people you love the most through difficulty. I love that. Yeah. And that's so true. We did have to choose when, when the pandemic hit, it was like, well, I don't know, are we bunking together or are we not? Yeah. Do I feel safe with you to come yeah. around my family, my children, my livelihood, whatever that is, yeah. we had to make choices and yeah. some people had to go, but it's a time for healing and reincorporating people back into your lives. Mm. I love that. Now, mm. Brittany, is this your, you guys' first time working with Portland Playhouse? Um, it is mine. It's her first time. But oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> this is my first time being in Portland. How has the experience been for you? Wonderful. Wonderful creative that. team, wonderful cast, um, super supportive. Yeah. Uh, a beautiful, beautiful environment to work in, to create, to share ideas, and to create a family within mm the cast yeah. because this play doesn't exist if the cast isn't like a family. No, for real. We have such a great time together. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. And Brittany, I hear that, you know, this is uh, the month of October. We're performing and you actually have a, a really good story to tell us. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And in July of this year, July 7th, I actually was diagnosed with triple negative breast cancer. Um, I've had multiple surgeries throughout this time, um, but when I found out, I didn't know that I would have to have chemo. Mm. And I made the choice to continue with this play. I needed something to live for. And um, though it's been difficult, I have chemo bi-weekly in San Diego, uh, where my family is, but I've chosen to stay with the cast and it was the best choice for me because if I didn't have something to get up for every day, it might be a lot more difficult yeah. to make it through this time. Yeah, so this play has almost maybe been uh, a type of therapy for you. 100%. Yeah. I get to go somewhere that I love. I live my dream and I get to be with people that I love, like genuinely, because we have created a family. So I have the ultimate support in a group of strangers that, I mean, my family is beautiful and supportive, but they cannot give me what my dream is, what my passion is. Mm. And so I get to show up every day and be with people who love me, support me, and we get to play. And we laugh <laughs> so much. For real. We, and that's part of the best medicine. <laughs> oh my laughter. God. We laugh so much. Yeah. Um, and Ashley has been particularly wonderful in this because she plays my daughter and I haven't had kids yet. Yeah. And uh, I really enjoy, it's therapeutic to be able to play her mom on stage, especially because we have such a great relationship 
on and off stage. I love mm -hmm. that. I love that. Well, we're actually going to get a little sneak peek of that, that chemistry coming up. Thank you so much, ladies, for being here. We really appreciate it, guys. It is time for a break, but I promise we will be right back with more Everyday Northwest.